in this episode of the Home Studio Show, I'm looking at Native Instruments Complete 13, Native Instruments Machine Plus, SoftTube Model 72 plugin, free plugins, and more. I'm Zane. Welcome to the Home Studio Show, where it's all about audio tech news and reviews to help you find new tools for your home studio. You can check it out on YouTube or you can download it as a podcast from thehomestudioshow.com. And just so you know, I've linked to all of the items mentioned in this episode of the Home Studio Show down in the description. So check down there if you're interested in anything. Also to note, I've added a new feature within the Home Studio Show and it's deals. It's current deals. So if you're interested in finding some of the best deals that are on right now, be sure to stick around for that. But now let's get into what's new. And first up is a couple of pieces of audio tech news from Native Instruments. The first being the release of Complete 13. This is Native Instruments flagship plugin collection. There are four bundles that you can choose from, which are Complete 13 Select, Complete 13, Complete 13 Ultimate, and Complete 13 Ultimate Collector's Edition. The difference is in the pricing and the amount of plugins that you get in each bundle. The included plugins range from 16 in the Select and up to 122 in the Ultimate Collector's Edition. Some of the new plugins in Native Instruments Complete 13 are the updated Guitar Rig 6, which has been redesigned with new amps, new effects, and other ways to sculpt your guitar tone. And you also get Super 8, which is a modern polyphonic synthesizer. Plus, there's the Noir plugin, which is a grand piano. And there are many other additions and updates in Native Instruments Complete 13. And while Native Instruments was at it, they've also released Machine Plus, which is a standalone production system similar to an Akai MPC. You can record into it, sequence with it, and it even includes 35 onboard effects. Machine Plus can be used as an all-in-one recording studio, a drum sampler, a synthesizer, and you can do all of this without the need to have it connected to a computer. You get nine instruments included, plus the 35 effects, and thousands of included sounds. Of course, you have the ability to expand this so you're not stuck with the factory settings. And also to note, it's not too cheap. This costs around $1,400, but if the idea of having the freedom and portability of an all-in-one production system appeals to you, this might be worth the money. Up next in audio tech news is the release of Isotope Neoverb. This is an intelligent reverb plugin featuring an AI-powered workflow to help you quickly find the right space for your vocals and your instruments. Neoverb's Reverb Assistant gives you a great starting point and you can also combine up to three different reverb engines at once, either through the Assistant or the BlendPad interface. Other highlights include the intelligent pre- and post-EQs that make suggestions to shape and tame reverb in the mix. Neoverb is available on Mac and Windows systems with a starting price of $199. You can also get this in the new Isotope Music Production Suite 4, which also includes RX-8 Standard, Ozone 9 Advanced, Neutron 3 Advanced, Nectar 3, plus more. Next up in audio tech news is the release of SoftTube's Model 72 plugin. This is a mini Moog emulation, which is a classic mono synth. The interface on this one looks great, and it can be inspiring just with the looks but the emphasis is really on the sound quality. SoftTube claims to have captured everything down to the smallest detail, including all of its quirks. They've also added some modern features like doubling and spread to create a stereo-like sound image, and you can get Model 72 on Mac or Windows with a starting price of just $99, but you can get a free trial to give it a test run first. Now let's look at some current deals that are happening. And first up is Waves Audio are having their early Black Friday sneak peek. This is where you can save up to 90% on some plugins. Plus, if you spend over $50, you get to choose another plugin for free. Or if you spend over $90, you can choose two plugins for free. Now check the link in the description for more information on that. Also, another deal that Waves has right now is you can get the One Knob Fatter plugin for free until October 11th, 2020. The next deal is from Plugin Boutique. 
Purchase any plugin and you'll get the WA Production Pumper 3 and Imprint Plugin Bundle for free. All you have to do is make sure you have the little box checked next to the Yes, I want to receive this gift. This offer is good until the end of October 2020. Now, before I get into this episode's plugins worth checking out, I just want to ask if you're enjoying this episode so far, can you please give it a thumbs up? It really helps my channel out and I appreciate it so much. Now, this week's plugins worth checking out. And the first one is Plugin Boutique's Scalar 2. Scalar 2 makes finding chords and progressions easy. It's a comprehensive but easy to use toolbox that can help you up your music creation. You can find your current projects key and then make decisions on progressions based on that key. And it also has hundreds of keys that you can choose from to build progressions with using the built-in sequencer. You can use Scalar 2 to control other VST instruments, or you can use it as an instrument itself with the built-in sounds. This is a huge program and there's so much more that it can do. So check the link in the description for even more information on Plugin Boutique's Scalar 2. The next plugin worth checking out is Waves Abbey Road Studio 3. And this is a plugin that I've been using quite a bit lately while I'm working on my EP. And what it does is it puts you in a virtual control room, specifically the Studio 3 at Abbey Road. You put this plugin at the end of your master bus chain and you can listen to how your mix would sound in their control room where numerous hit records and songs have been created. There are three different sets of monitors that you can switch between. There's near, mid, and far, and each one has its own sound. Also, if you have the Waves NX system, it can track your head movement, so if you turn to the left, it's going to sound like you just turned to the left. And you don't need to have that system, though. I don't have it, and this still works fine for me. What this plugin really helps with is making sure that your mix will translate which is a huge problem for music producers, especially home studio producers like me that don't have the greatest acoustic rooms to mix in. You get three versions of this plugin. There's the stereo, 5.1 stereo, and 7.1 stereo, but there's no mono option. If mix translation has been an issue for you like it has been for me, then check out the Waves Abbey Road Studio 3 plugin. So I'm going to do a bit of a demo here and I'm not sure how it's going to sound coming through as it's not going to sound the greatest and that's the point of this is it doesn't sound the greatest but if you can make your mix sound great within this plugin then your mix is likely going to sound great elsewhere. We can't rock We don't now it's time for the free plugins of the week. And first up this week is Scandiclavia from Fanan Team. This is a virtual analog organ that's equipped with two 32-bit waveform engines, which generate two organ module emulations, and each one has their own color, precision organ and Hammond-style electric organ. Scandiclavia is inspired by the Clavia Nord organ sound, although it uses a slightly different synthesis approach. It's available as a 32-bit or as a 64-bit plugin on Windows only. The next free plugin of the week is from Tekkit Audio. This is Rec Soprano 2. This one is based on original samples of a soprano recorder that was sampled by Mahai Sorahan. The instrument features traditional tuning, envelope control, velocity parameters, polyphonic voices, reverb, and you can even see the fingerings display while playing it. It's available as a 32-bit or 64-bit plugin on both Windows and Mac. And if you want to check out even more free VST plugins, click up here. 
or click down here to see what YouTube recommends. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. For Simple Green Tech and the Home Studio Show, I'm Zane. Keep creating, and we'll talk soon.